slime. <laughs> the most genius drink ever. I have to become a part of this. Because every successful person has a successful business partner. Just like Bill Gates and Paul Allen, or Phineas and Ferb, and soon to be me and Oliver Tree. I had three steps to make this happen. Recreate it, market it, and finally, get Oliver Tree's attention to let me on board. The first thing I have to do is recreate it, which starts with fixing it because... Calories, 3,000. <laughs> We're still working out the calorie count. I'm trying to get this shit down. So I'm going to fix that. The goal was simple, get less calories and even more hydration than any drink ever before. Slime was an innovation to the community. I saw the vision that it would change the way people hydrate. And I wouldn't give this away without getting people to taste test this first. So that's what I did. People were so excited, they formed a line to taste test it. They were the first to taste test Slime V2. And let me tell you, the ratings were incredible. I've been making slime. <laughs> All night. That, I just realized how weird that sounds. Step one was now done, and it was time to release and market it to the public. So I created a website, Instagram, TikTok, and even a YouTube. I was making a ridiculous amount of videos that were actually doing good. Was about to get Prime, but then got Slime instead. Don't drink Prime. Drink Slime. I even made the most amazing commercial. This is Prime. And this is Slime. There were extremely dedicated fans that absolutely loved Slime. This one got me pretty bad. I thought it was actually Oliver Tree, but it was just Fernando. While I continued to market, I was also fulfilling Oliver Tree's promises. And we are putting these in stores everywhere in the next two to three months. That's exactly what I did. I filled every store I could think of. I was showing Oliver Tree the true potential of his drink and why it would be the greatest business partner. I was even stalking the competition store. So Logan Paul and KSI sell their Prime at Walmart. So we're here to take over and sell our slime. And I wasn't alone. I got the first Slime Incorporated employee. New hydration drink we're trying out? Yeah, I'm trying to work with that. Water. Yeah, zero calories. Zero calories. Hey, did you guys want to try slime? Slime hydration. Slime hydration? That's for you, man. Prime. Yeah, f prime. <laughs> what I can taste like a Gatorade. Free slime. Thank you, thank slime was being spread every way possible. And now word of mouth. As I gave a hundred bottles of slime to the people. Yep. That's what I'm saying! I wanted to make sure everybody could have a taste of slime. On a scale of 1 to 10, how is the slime? Oh, fuck the Richter scale, we go to 3,000. The vision I had earlier was coming true. It was slowly spreading by word of mouth and becoming the best drink in the world. It was changing the way people hydrate. I had to think bigger though. Slime was a company, and every company had a billboard. So that's why I got a billboard. This is for Oliver. Now everyone driving by will keep this at. By this point, Slime was practically a household name, so it was on to the final step. I had to get Oliver Tree's attention. Tons of people have gotten huge creators' attention by saying their name a hundred thousand times. I personally have never seen one that hasn't worked, so... I'm about to go live on TikTok. Here's the counter at zero. I will have Oliver Tree's attention. Oliver Tree. I'm not gonna bore you with this because this was so awful. So here's some of the highlights, I guess? So absolutely miserable. Uh, we've been doing this for like 13 hours. And after 21 hours of saying Oliver Tree, Oliver Tree's sexy. Oliver Tree, please be my business partner. Oliver Tree, slime for you, Oliver Tree. Let's go! It didn't even work, but I was happy to be done. So that night, I got tickets to his tour, and I had something amazing to bring him. 